talk to me. Information, news, and entertainment on demand. WSRadio.com. <laughs> Welcome to the Changing Stage, music gear talk from the manufacturers and musicians who define the biz. Here's your host, Florentino Buenaventura. All right, this is another segment of the Changing Stage radio show powered by the mighty WS Radio Networks, the worldwide leader in internet talk radio. And brought to you by Pitbull Audio at pitbullaudio.com, SIR Music Equipment Rental at sir-usa.com, Stars Line Now at starslinenow.com, and uh, California Music Studios at californiamusicstudios.com. And we've been having such a great day here at Westlake Audio, and and it's been an amazing session produced by Kevin Flournoy with so many incredibly talented players. We're very honored to have... April Doyle, who the, is the artist today, doing some in, uh, songs that uh, have really been an inspiration for her in this remarkable place with these remarkable players, and she's also part of a remarkable band called Hot Chile. Hot Chile Productions. Hot, okay, yes. So, April, you're you're like putting together an amazing recording project. Tell us about that project. Thank you. It's beyond exciting it's um something i have been uh basically promoting they you know the corporate show band yes. for quite a few years and um i what i did was i put together a different kind of a show band with all industry players like industry musicians yes so it has a different feeling on stage because they are very excited about playing together yeah so it's very cool. I've got serious jazz guys, serious funk guys, and it, it's it's an amazing combination. So and you emulated it here in the recording studio. You've had people that, you know, are vocalists for Michael Jackson, uh, you know, guitar players for the Gap Band, you know, drummers that are playing for the president. I mean, this this is an amazing, uh, you know, undertaking. It, it's it that yes, and that's the kind of guys that I have in the band as well. I've got Parliament Funkadelics drummer wow. i've got uh people that have played for elton john and i mean it's just it, it's it makes it a little difficult sometimes if they get called out on the road for a bit yeah, yeah. i may have to sub, sub them yeah luckily it's not doesn't happen that often but um the uh the level of player i have in the corporate show band has been awesome and through those connections um, I've had people ask me for years, when are you going to do your project? Yeah. And I have been put it on the, I have put it on the back burner for so long. And so now as to all my professional friends prodding, <laughs> I am here in this fabulous studio with yet another, some of the people in my group and their extended family. musical family yeah. with all these other amazing players. So to get vocal coaching today from, Kevin Dorsey, one of Michael Jackson's main guys for his entire career, has been yeah. awe-inspiring. Yeah, yeah, I know. We, you know, hearing the stories he was telling. Yeah, the biggest thing I think we got to kick out of is the uh, Ferris Bueller's. Oh yeah, I know. When I heard that, <laughs> I'm like, of course that's you. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, yeah, that was awesome. <laughs> so you got to throw that in, in, in a show sometime. That'd I know, awesome. right? <laughs> I told him he needs to write a book. <laughs> so. How did you kind of come into this particular place where you put together this amazing corporate band? Because it just doesn't happen overnight. It doesn't. I was um, my partner in uh, that has been my partner for most of the existence of the band. Uh, Mark Jones okay. knew a lot of major people, and so he said, "Let me put some of these guys together." And um, you know, it's a process over the years, but there are some people that have stayed there for quite a while. Yeah. And um, they've been unbelievable. And when you're working with that level of player, all the other people that they know have been, like I've been able to pull other people in for this project. And Kevin Flournoy, who is the spearhead of this, mm -hmm. has been unbelievable. He's got the connections here at Westlake Studios yeah. and all these other, Kevin Dorsey and all these other people yeah. who he pulled into this project. So my musical family has grown through this project exactly. as well. It's been Amazing. And so is your media family because, you know, him he bringing us in, he's going to be doing a radio show with us. And he told me about this project. That 
he just basically invited us to say, hey, just come out and just ch- ch- check it out. I'm like, oh, man, we got to go in there and, and do something different. We, Mike's we, blazing. Yeah, we got to yeah. go Mike's blazing. So, you know, when we heard about this, we thought your project would be the perfect one because you're doing it the right way. You're at a, a real studio. Using that, the best guys, best studio. Yeah. This, uh, yeah. Play, Thank you record, for saying that. You're recording it in Michael Jackson's room. You know, it was designed specifically for him. And, you know, and, and you're capturing such an amazing level of performance. Your vocals, I know that you're not like, you know, you're still working on doing some more tr- mm-hmm. vocal tracks, but your vocals are just already amazing. And you pick songs that are very personal to you, right? I did. They're very personal, they're very classic. Uh, Nancy Wilson's yeah. Save Your Love, uh, classic Betcha by Golly Wow, um, and uh, The Wishing on a Star. Yes. And Kevin, with his amazing abilities, is helping me to render these in a more current, uh, I don't want to say pop, I, I don't know why I'm kind of backing off of it, but it is a little bit more current. Yeah. You know, I mean, there is a trend, it's been going on for quite a few years now, that people are hearing these standards and classic tunes that are being rendered in a, in a, in a more yeah. uh, current way, and they're liking them a younger crowd is hearing these beautiful classic songs and liking them and yeah. which you know they wouldn't have known them on their own a lot of people are tired of all the uh synthetic mechanic yeah and mechanical music that's going on right now and there is none of that on there the, we're here the players are playing it all live and take it and they're going back if one guy's like i'm not good with that they go back and they all go redo it again yeah so and it, it's very organic in the way you're approaching it i know that we don't have a whole lot of time with you because you got to get back to recording but we're going to have you come into the the station and actually do, uh you know uh, you know kind of expand upon this project but i want to you know want to ask how many songs are you going to do and when do you think it's going to be out the the ep is going to have six songs on it um i would say i mean it's hard to nail down exactly when it's going to be done i would say less definitely less than six months it's going to be yeah, done four songs today right three. three three songs okay three and then we're doing uh some more originals and then there's going to be some performances and some other recordings this is kind of so like I said, to launching with a very interesting energy that's uh, exciting and everyone's into it. So yeah. seeing the everyone being excited, that we're going to schedule more things to happen quicker, yeah, which yeah. is an awesome thing. That that and, and I think that's the key is that there's this momentum. We feel it in here, and I, I think picking the spot really kind of helped out with that. Definitely. So you know, I, I really appreciate you being on here. I know that you got to get back, and we don't want to keep you too long. But we're going to have you come down to our studios in, in uh, Mir- Mira Mesa, and uh, you know, and we're going to expand upon that and kind of really kind of delve into you know uh, where April Doyle kind of got her inspirations and all that stuff. So you guys got to stay tuned. She will be down, and we'll, we're going to have a really good and we'll do it a live segment there. So awesome. uh, this has been the Changing Stage Radio Show, powered by the Mighty WS Radio Networks. Thank you again to Pitbull Audio SIR. Stars Align and um, California Music Studios had you know, it's been a long day, <laughs> and uh, you know make sure you guys go out to the uh, Stars Align show that's happening on April or July fifteenth, and I said April cause April's on my mind, and then of course uh, uh, you know the, the, we got some other concerts that are coming up in, in July with the Rock and Roll Reunion and the Aristocrats coming up in uh, uh, August at UCSB. So. Thanks again, and stay tuned for some more Changing Stage.